What's up, Creepers, and Keepers, Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today, guys, over at Atari.io? We are having a very special High School Squad Challenge. We're going to be playing Game 6 of Yaz Revenge in honor of our 6th annual Howard Scott Warshaw Day, the 30th being his birthday, the 30th of July, if you're watching this sometime in the future. And if you don't know, Howard Scott Warshaw is the mastermind behind this amazing game, his masterpiece, if you ask me. Um, he raised the Lost Ark and, of course, E.T., you know. Um, but, yeah. So, we're playing game six. I don't venture outside just a game that plays when you put the cartridge in and you hit power. Uh, Space Invaders, I'll do that. Maybe Air Sea Battle and some uh, some combat. Even, uh, I guess, uh, um, Indy. Indy 500, I'll do that, too. Uh, as you saw in my... Uh, my video on Indy 500. Um, so I read about what this one is all about. See, all right, and this is what I was going to talk about. You have to eat some part of the shield, like six bites or six nibbles, in order to be able to get your cannon. I hate doing it because it bounces you. It's kind of like in Castlevania when, you know, you, you jump backwards when, uh, when something touches you. It's like a death fucking sentence, but you have to nibble on it so many times in order to be able to get your cannon. And you don't get your cannon like you do in the game normally by touching the dude here. You have to go all the way to the left. There it is. And then you're going to play around it. And it bounces if it touches the shield. <laughs> wow, I didn't expect that. Oh, okay. Can I still get it? No, I gotta go back and nibble. So I guess it resets every time. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Alright, can I get me? There it is. Bam! Okay, okay, we got this. But yeah, the only thing I'm noticing is it's just a little bit different how you get your cannon. And the curse is just a little faster. Um, there is another way for you to get your cannon. And if you clear away the shield enough. Uh, I think you have to clear away all the shell, in fact. Um, if you touch... If you touch Homeboy over here, and then go back to the left of the screen, you can get your uh, cannon. Um, that was a waste of shot, but... I didn't need it yet. I just wanted to see if I was able to get it yet. Which is a waste, right? Ah, see, that's why I don't like nibbling! Fucking nibbling. Fucking Howard Scott Warshaw. Hey, happy birthday, buddy. <laughs> there we go. Ah, uh, can I get it yet? No. I believe you can do that. Come over here. Oh, God. Gotta do that. And come over here. Uh, go back up, dude. Well, I can't aim. I can't aim this. What the damn. There we go, there we go. Ah, oh, you bat. Do I have to touch him each time? No, I don't. There we go. There we go, we got it. Yeah, but Yaz Revenge, I mean, what do I have to say about Yaz Revenge? I mean, amazing game. Amazing game. Top five games of all time, in my opinion. You don't get much much better than this. I mean, and, and you know what? And there's really nothing out there that's like it. I mean, what genre would you call this? Is it a shooter? I guess it's a shooter. But everything about this game is perfect. The animation of the R, the animation of the other dude. Sorry, I can't remember the names of these fucking things. Alright? Fail. I'm failing you guys. Um, This thing here, where I'm at now, the little protection zone. Brilliant, dude. Fucking brilliant. Uh, there's, I guess there's some history to it, too. Uh, it was just some kind of a goofy thing, and it's actually part of the coding of the game. But, I don't know. I don't know. It's just, it's, this game is just brilliant. It's, it's just nothing shy of a fucking masterpiece. And I would have fucking loved to have gotten it while he's doing his little spinny dealio. Go back up. Oh, that was dumb. I wasted that one. Oh, I was too busy. I was too busy watching him. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, shit. Oh, 
It's like it knew I was going in for the kill, too. Oh, that was cheap. That was like by the skin of my fucking teeth, though. Or by the skin of his fucking teeth. Damn, we got it. We got it. Even this right here. <sighs> I'll nibble a little. Uh -huh. Oh, the rest of this I'm just gonna shoot away. Oh, I went the wrong way! God damn it. Wait a minute, did it start over? Fuck! I didn't take my score. <laughs> I didn't write down my score. It was like 30-something thousand, right? I'm going to have to look at it in a little bit before, you know, so I can write it down. In case. Yeah, it did. Damn it. I need to keep track of that. The high school squad challenge. Wait, have I eaten enough to get a... No. going to be a fucking glutton over there. Let's get this thing. Let's get this thing and do it. Let's do it. Whammo! I got him while he was preparing to fire. Look at that. Look at that. Love that score. I gotta stop hitting the button. I gotta stop hitting the button before it's time to hit the button. And, th and that's exactly what happened. As soon as you hit the, the uh, action button, well, I'll call it the fire button, um, the game... Either starts back up or resets, you know, depending on where you are. I mean, if you have more lives left, then of course it's just going to bring you into the next whatever. But if, you, if you've spent all of your lives, it's literally just, um, starts the game over. Instead of using a select. Oh, what the fuck? See, I don't like nibbling. I fucking hate it. Oh, that was dumb. Alright. I'm gonna have to clear these away so I can do the uh, tried and true. Tried and true. Let me see. Oh. Yeah, okay. I've nibbled enough. There we go. We got it. We got it. I'm doing better. One life after this. Oh, shit. I've got one life to live. I'll just shoot from afar here. Fuck this guy. Can I get the cannon yet? Yes! Come on over here, you fucking dash. Blammo! Got it! Oh, because I'm doing this on, uh... I mean, I guess I could insert the word blammo. I'm not editing this on my, my cellular device. This is going to come straight from the computer. No! No. I'm doing well now. Ah, <laughs> that was risky. Holy shit. Ah! 30,887. I'll write that down. 30887. Alright, let's just... Let's play one more. One more. Right. Oh shit, I went to the wrong place. Went to the wrong place. I zigged when I should have zagged. There we go. Alright. I will say it, it's pretty cool that when, uh, the cannon fucking hits his shield. Watch. This shit just bounces. Boink. Boink. <laughs> All right. oh, I was hoping that would sneak in there, too. Gonna say that got him. <laughs> so 
Sorry, this game excites me. This one pumps my nads. Oh, I thought I was directly underneath the damn thing. Guess what? I thought wrong. I thought wrong. See, that, that's going to be my strategy. Just keep going up and down. All right. I think I got enough there. Let him come over here. Oh, I gotta go back and nibble. Is that enough? No, oh, man, come on. I love this game. I, I, I'm sorry I'm not talking too much. I just I can't I have to concentrate. This is one of those games. I think when I played this live, I said the same shit. I was like, sorry guys, I'm not talking. I, 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 what the hell? Uh, did I get my cannon and fire it off? I didn't mean to. All right. Uh, all right, one more. One more life. Whoa! Whoa, it was like my first time, you know what I mean? And just prematurely just blew it out. <laughs> she was pretty pissed. I'm pretty sure. I'm not saying her name. <laughs> Let's see if we can't sneak one in the middle. No, I guess not. Alright. Let's get this chance. Oh! I was robbed of that one. Actually, no. I, I was, I'll, I'll admit, that was... Uh, Poor planning on my part as far as when to when to fire off. There it is. Spirit of Halloween just emailed me. I was at a where was that today? Michael's fuck. Uh thirty-seven thousand, that's more. Thirty-seven ninety-two. Okay. Three seven zero nine two. I'll live with that, you know. That was pretty cool. I've never really played it. At game six or anything like that, but that was that was really cool. So, uh, you know, I'm glad Justin switches it around like this um, when we go to play these games. Uh, it makes it a lot more interesting. Yeah, would I love to have just jammed in fucking Yaz Revenge and played it? Of course I would have. But this is a new experience, and it's it's like a new take on an old friend. You know what I mean? And uh, that's really all there is to it. So, guys, thanks as always so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Howard Scott Warshaw, if you're watching, bro. First of all, thank you for all your wonderful gifts, this game included. And happy birthday to you, brother. Happy birthday, and here's to many more. Mm. It's fucking empty. But either way, guys, don't forget you can win all kinds of stuffs. Bottom bottom video at the end of the screen, at the end of this video. I'll tell you everything you need to know if you just go into the description. Plus, I'm giving away another thing, the first $50 donation in Alzheimer's Association down below. We'll get you a free handheld. Game console that's custom painted in Greeblied by me. And of course, I have a bunch of uh, video game dust sleeves by video game dust sleeves. So, guys, hope you donate to the Alzheimer's Association. It's such a great cause. And you can get all kinds of cool stuff. And more stuff keeps rolling in for incentive. But either way, like I said a few minutes ago, thank you always so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Until next time, take care. Creep it real. Happy Monday. And bye bye.